just a fantastic test match, wasn't it? Like it's you, you look at a lot of the test matches through the through history, and that one sort of had it, had its ups and downs, and momentum sways and swings as much as uh, as any that's probably ever been played. So, um, look, just a great test, and it, it sort of typifies Ashes cricket, I think, especially the way that it's been played in the last four or five series. You know, it's, and a lot of the time the first test has gone that way as well. So, um, yeah, a really intriguing battle, and um, one I think both teams would be better for. Great play from both sides, seesawing wildly from one side to the other and, and then the dramatic conclusion as well. So, I mean, it was a brilliant game of cricket. In some ways, shame there had to be a loser, but obviously I'm quite happy that England won. I expect Australia got a lot more out of that first test than England. I know England won 1-0, but I think Australia got a lot more out of it and um, I think they performed pretty well at Lords. No, no. Amazing, a guy gets 10 wickets in one match and everyone's saying, oh, we're over-reliant on him. Enjoy the moment. The guy's brilliant. Watch him bowl. Watch the other guys bowl. At the end of the day, you've got to take 20 wickets. Jimmy, on this occasion, took 10. Who knows? Uh, Graham Swan might take 10 in the next game. Um, obviously, the wicket at Lords, with the weather the way it is, it's, it's going to be a little bit drier and a, a little bit harder for the fast bowlers, but um, I think there's more room for improvement in the Australian attack than there is in the English attack. Yeah, look, if I was Australia, I wouldn't be changing the team. There'll be, there, there will be a bit of talk probably about their batting lineup. Um, England's batting lineup was fine. They'll probably have a bit of talk around their fast bowling lineup going, going back to Lords. So I, I wouldn't expect too many changes from any team. Well, I think Australia got a job on their hands. I think that was a really important test match, probably more important for them than England. Um, so they're going to have to fight very hard at Lords. I think the, the toss at Lords is going to be really important. If England win that and bat, uh, it's going to be hard for Australia.